checkboxes and freezing rows or columns. This is another flipped classroom tutorials. After my previous video on macros in Google Sheets, I would like to do a very short and quick tutorial on using tick boxes or checkboxes and freezing rows. So let's go ahead and quickly make a sheet and we're going to have three names in this sheet. We're going to have name one, name two and name three. Now there are a number of tasks that these people have to complete. So we have task one, task two and so on and so on. So what we can do is we can easily select these two, drag it down and automatically create all the titles. Now we have all these tasks and three people are going to fulfill these tasks. Now previously adding tick boxes was a workaround. You had to insert images or you had to find another way of inserting these tick boxes. Now it's as simple as selecting all the cells where you would like to see a checkbox or tick box. You are going to go to insert and then you select tick box. This quickly inserts a tick box that you can then tick on or off depending on its value. Now another thing that you can do now is freeze rows straight and right from your menu. Now previously you had to drag these lines down to freeze the first row and then drag this to the side to freeze this first column. Now you can do this by simply going to view and freeze. Now here you can select no rows, no columns or you can say freeze one row, view, freeze, freeze one column. Now hopefully this will make it much easier for people to quickly freeze different rows in their spreadsheets. I hope you found this very short little tutorial helpful. If you did, don't forget to check out my other videos. You can find them on the channel. You can subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for updates. I thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.